And of course, you can see in my face that after the performance uh, from the team, we are very disappointed that we didn't get something out of the game. Because I think we played very well, but we didn't get the result. So, uh, first of all, there is a strong belief in the team, among the players, that we can do it in Benin. Because the day we are today, the, day we, the way we play today, I think even Benin also said, hey, they can play football, but they didn't take their chances. And I think Benin are very, very happy that they get away with a 1-0 win here. Because I think first half was quite even. Maybe we have the biggest chances. Simon had a big chance in first half as well. Second half, we tried to push and push. And I think everybody in the stadium had a feeling it's a matter of time, then Tanzania will score. But we missed our chances, we created the chances, and we didn't take them. And then suddenly, out of the blue, in a, you can say, personal skills from number nine, Mounier, he made a fantastic goal, and that gave the Benin, uh, unfortunately gave them the result. I think it was the only chance Benin created in second half, if you can say it was a chance, because it was a moment of individual skills. So we managed to keep an opponent, and don't forget, Benin is an experienced team. They are number 80 on the FIFA ranking. We managed to push them and create a high number, not of small chances, but big chances. And at the same time, we protected our own goal and we didn't give any chances away. So the player, they are of course, like me, say, ah, this was a we, we, we wanted a better result because we, we thought we, we played for it. But we lost one battle, but the war is on. In three days' time, we are going to Benin and play in Benin. And we have a strong belief in ourselves that we can do and get a win in Benin. And I also think Benin uh, will say today it was a very lucky win for us. We are very happy to get away with a win here because that was... Uh, the, the game belonged to Tanzania, they pushed all the way. So surely they will have the respect when we are coming to Benin as well. And we have a belief, sometimes a game where you dominate, you can lose. But next time we will push again and I hope we will take our chances and we will get a good result in Benin. When you are on a journey, like a World Cup qualification, and you play tough teams, Congo, Madagascar, Benin, there will be some bump on the way and in life on your journey there will be some bump obstacles on the way those who keep believing themselves and believe in each other that is the people who will go far those who start to say ah uh, no no we believe in ourselves and after the performance today we even believe more that we can make the result in Benin so for me the World Cup uh, qualification journey is still very very much open and everything can happen in the group, for sure. And I think Benin, they know as well. Thank you very much. Any questions? First of all, very strong for us, because we have believed that they can be absent from this match. What that game, you get it all at once. And you will be just confident. You think we're going to win our way. For your team, as you, as you saw today, they get a lot of chances, but you can make it. I think it's going to be easy away in Benin. No, I don't think there will be any World Cup qualification matches when we are playing against teams who are higher ranking than us. It will never be easy, but we have a belief and we have a strong belief that we can make it. Because we have played Congo away, we got a point, we deserve that one. And uh, today at home, we I think we deserve the win. And if you look at the chances and the way we played, so of course we have a strong belief in ourselves, for sure. And the players, they have a strong belief in themselves. The only thing I didn't, I didn't like today, I didn't like that the referee allowed so many times uh, the players from uh, Benin to hit from behind, because that's one of the things in international football, the referee have been advised, kick from behind, shoot the referee. And there were one player, he was three or four times, he was doing exactly the same, bang from behind, and the referee was not even giving a yellow card. I told the referee after the game, 
that point you get you get wrong. I'm not blaming the referee for the for the that we didn't win because that is up to ourselves to take our chances. We will prepare very nicely. Remember, for this camp, we had two days of preparation. Two days of preparation. That's all we have. So we will prepare the next few days, go to Benin tomorrow, and we will be more than ready to fight all the way to get a good result. I can promise you that. Asante, Asante.